Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be what I eat a day on a bulk. So today I'm going to show you guys some meal options, but it does vary for me on a bulk. I kind of like to play around with my food. As long as I'm hitting my macros, I kind of um, have room to play around versus on a cut. I'm more strict. It's a little bit more boring and I keep things simple as heck. Um, but for today or for right now, um, my current calories are at 2,700. My protein, I try and hit around 145. Carbs, 370. And fats at 70. My fats are the hardest thing for me to hit. My calories, my macros in general, meal plan, it's very big. Um, not many people are able to consume this much, especially at my size, and not gain excessive amount of weight. My metabolism is super high. It's been this way since I first started my journey. It's always been a struggle to gain mass, muscle mass, and weight. So my numbers may be a lot higher than somebody else's, so I wouldn't necessarily reach for this if you're trying to bulk, but this is just some um, ideas on what you can do to get to your own goals um, and it may give you just some more options as far as like fats carbs and proteins go but if you have any questions feel free to leave them down below push like on this video if you want to see more like this one and subscribe to my channel this is my first video I'm super excited nervous um, have a lot of emotions right now and I'm trying to film this intro before the Sun goes down um, and I hope you guys love it. If you have any more ideas for me, let me know, like I said. And let's get this video started. Oh, and I will choose, I will update you guys at the end of this video, you know, where we left off on our macros and see how close we hit to my goals. So for meal one, I'm having Kodiak cakes. Um, I do a cup of Kodiak cakes with a cup of milk. And you can do almond milk if you want. I just got regular milk. And then and one egg, and then we mix it. And we, I'm going to cook like three of them. I just fin finished making meal one. My first pancake came out perfect. The second, the second one got burnt a little. And the other one came out just stupid. So at least we have one good packet on there, but I'm sure it's all going to taste the same. So I just threw a bunch of syrup on it and it's, I'm doing the sugar-free Monero by sugar-free syrup by Maple Grove Farms. This is like the best syrup ever. It doesn't taste different than regular syrup and it's better for you. In so this clip, it was my first time making the Kodiak cakes. I had tried them before, but never made them. So this is my fourth time making them and they looked way better with some turkey bacon. It was amazing. So right now I just made my intro workout on the next clip. I'll go ahead and show you guys what I put in it. But basically I drink this during my workout. It helps fuel my workout, especially if I have, am I a little bit hungry before or during this kind of just helps me, keeps me good until after my workout when I can eat again or have a protein shake. So I will show you guys my supplementation just in case you were wondering what I take. Um, cause I get that question on a daily basis basis. And I feel like it kind of correlates to what I eat a day. Cause it's like what I drink in a day too. <laughs> So during my workout, I mix two scoops of carbolin, which is carbs, but they're intra carbs, so they're easier to process. And then I take tango, which is creatine, and then I take glutamine to help with recovery. Um, and then also the grind, which is BCAAs and EAAs. Um, and I mix all of it together. Most of them are all like cherry, like fruit punch flavors. So they mix very well together. And then I drink it during my workout. Today, I'm honestly probably not going to be taking pre-workout. I did get a coffee this morning that I haven't finished. Um, because I was super hungry this morning before or when I woke up. So I ate instantly. I didn't really get to drink my coffee as much. So we're just going to do some pump. And um, I will show you the pump in my car when we get to the gym. I'm going to do legs today. Starting on a Monday with legs. Not really happy about it, but we're gonna get it done. So, cheers! I need to know what coffee I get from Starbucks. I get normally a nitro cold brew. Today they didn't have cold brews on a Monday. I don't understand. But basically, I always get with almond milk. I'll get two Splendas and three pumps, or three Splendas and two pumps of sugar-free vanilla, and it tastes amazing. This tastes similar to the nitro cold brew. Not gonna lie, the iced coffee, and it's actually two dollars cheaper. So, I mean, win for me this morning. Um, but super good. Quick, I wanted to show you guys my outfit for today. This is a free people bra. Um, 
it's super cute it was 58 dollars though don't know if i would want to spend that all the time but i just treated myself and i was like let's just get it it's super soft um the back is super cute um shows the little back muscles and then i paired it with the ombre seamless leggings from gymshark one of my favorite leggings um honestly and then i pair it with some black converse for leg day so i can have a flat surface and i'm feeling cute today my hair is not dead today i did not feel like getting it done i showered last night it's woke up crazy but it's a vibe so i ended up finishing my leg day workout and now i am back home and i'm about to eat my post-workout meal you're probably noticing the video quality change in this video i just got a new camera my old camera um had gotten dented got dented um during covid um a tire kind of like flipped on it so i always wanted to get it fixed and it's taking me so long to get it fixed because it's going to take a while to get it fixed it's just like a hassle so i just decided to buy a new camera so that's what you are seeing now i'm so excited to have a camera finally and to get this youtube rolling so i'm going to show you guys what i'm having for my post-workout meal it's super simple so for post-workout meal i'm having about 18 grams of sweet potato fries um ground beef it's about six ounces of lean ground beef so 96.4 and then i am having a little bit of zucchini noodles and sugar-free ketchup next i'm gonna be having a snack i'm gonna have a full banana and i'm gonna have some raw almonds i am super low on my fats for today I'm only at like 20 grams so i'm gonna eat these to catch up and then um also have a banana to help with carbs today was leg day so higher carb day which is a great snack for me so i'm excited gotta get the protein in so i'm gonna be doing a scoop of hexapro i love this protein from all max um you can get it at rocks discount if you are in san antonio with just mention my name at the 88 of super Chinka road location and you'll get 15 percent off your your order um or your, your purchase but basically i wish this would freaking focus let me see if it does oh there we go so calories are 170 per serving two grams of fat and proteins at 25 grams and carbs is at 12. this is a little bit more of a higher carb protein as well as calories i do have a smaller calorie one but since i am bulking i want more for the scoop if that makes sense i want more of everything in each scoop so love this and the cookies and cream flavor is the bestest ever it tastes exactly like oreos so highly recommend the cool thing about this protein is that when you get a new one, because I had an open one, I had a brand new one, is that the scoop is like right on top. <laughs> so you don't got to dig in there for it. And then you can just put it back on there when you are done using it. And then I'm putting one scoop in there. And then I'll mix it in with my fork. Yeah, I need to mix this some more. But I'm going to put a little bit more because I think I put too much water. I want it to be a little bit sweeter, so I'm going to put like half a scoop. So this is going to be the last meal of the day. It is pasta. What I did is I put the 96.4 ground beef. I cook it and I brown it. And then after it's done cooking, I add in the sauce. Um, I use any just sauce. Um, the garlic and herb one is super good. So I always use the one that says something similar to that. Um, there's so many options though. And then I get the ready pasta already. So this is like a cheap way to like make pasta. I hate boiling pasta. It's so annoying. So basically I took half of it and half of it and it can make two servings. Um, so then after I um, put the, the sauce in there and it's pretty hot and the meat's hot, I just mix in the pasta with it after warming it up and I'm put it in the pan all together and it tastes delicious. So I'm gonna eat all of this. It was leg day, so more carbs. And then I'm gonna have a snack. I'm gonna have a little bit of salsa verde with a little bit of chips. So I always have like a little bit of a bad snack in my day. Um, and today I didn't reach my fats, so this will help a little bit. Real quick, I kinda wanted just to show y'all where we left off for today. So goal was 2,700 cows. Um, we reached 2,600, but give or take with like sauces and stuff like that, you know, you can miss and or go over a bit. And um, I'm pretty sure we got close to 2,700 anyways. Our protein was like around 165 grams. Fats were at 60 grams when they should have been like around 75. But I'm not too I'm not too mad about that as long as I hit my protein. That's like what matters more than my fats, in my opinion, for my body. Um, carbs for me, I missed by 25 grams. 
Um, so literally, I was at 347 and I was supposed to get to 370, so we're good. Um, but basically, that's pretty much it for tonight. I wanted to just mention really fast that I do season my food. Um, I usually put like lemon pepper, garlic salt, or garlic powder, Creole, or Julio seasoning, or seasonal. It just depends like what I'm in the mood for. But definitely season your food if you feel fit to do so, especially if you're trying to just live a healthy lifestyle or you're bulking and you want to make your healthy foods taste great. Um, definitely recommend don't make it just dry and torture yourself. And um, what else was I going to say? Oh, and I also drink two liters of these waters or I'll drink a gallon a day. Um, like a, a gallon instead of just two, you know, I just drink a full gallon. I do have some small cheats in my days. If I feel fit to do so, if I have room in my intake to do so as well, um, on my bulk, on my cut, like I said, I don't really cheat a lot, um, only if I feel fit to do so and it's more strict and I don't have a lot of room to play around. So just wanted to throw that out there. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day or night, wherever you are right now. Excuse my face. This is my no makeup face <laughs> and pale face. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it through the video, go ahead and give it a like, a thumbs up if you liked it and want to see more like this one. And um, let me know what else you want to see, like I said in the beginning. And um, subscribe to this channel so that way you can see more videos. Thank you guys so much for all your support. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.